Hello friends, today we are going to learn how to create amazing movie poster or any poster in Photoshop. So let's begin our tutorial. First we are take a new document, so just click on file, then click on new. Then create your own document size such as take your own weight and height and make resolution 300 because this one is very important. Then just press create button. So your document is ready and our second work we just place some images in our new document. So first first this one is our first image and I think this one is my background. So simply drag and drop into your new background new document and adjust the size of image. Our next work we just remove this man so just select this one by using laser tool and go to edit feel and content aware then press ok the, the man is automatically removed from your image then deselect this one you can also press Ctrl D for deselection or you can also use this option for deselection. So this one is done. And our next step we just select this man image by using pen tool. This one is my favorite tool. Just zoom your image by pressing Ctrl plus. This one helps you to select the difficult areas. So start your selection. This one is a very boring part. So I'm going to my video a little. So I'm going to make my video a little bit faster. So when you complete your selection just press ctrl minus then right click and go to make selection and make, make feather edition 0 pixel then press ok. So your image is selected now we are going to inverse our selection. So this one is selected press ctrl c plus v. This one is in another document. Now we are going to make changes on this area. So just select this area then press ctrl c plus d go to edit transform and flip horizontal and place this one go to edit transform and warp so the work is done and march the both layer uh, this one is marked and our next work we just draw a circle so take a blank layer go to material and create a circle fill this one by solid color just like I feel this one yellow then take a blank layer both select both the layer and just march so this one is totally free and select this one this time using quick selection tool and go to selection and select modify and contrast and make this one 20 pixels and press ok so this one is too small I'm going to increase the pixels 40 pixels I think this one is perfect for me so this one is completed and press delete key then deselect this one and this one is the plasma ray so just drag and drop this one and go to 
blending mode and select screen again duplicate this one then again duplicate this one the basic work is almost completed and our next step we just add shadow to provide realistic look so this one is the model image and we are going to take a blank layer and just take a brush make opacity 100% make foreground color black then simply apply this This one is the easiest process to create shadow. Then go to new layer, make opacity. Just click on blending mode and select overlay. Then go to first. We are going to clipping this one. Then go to edit, fill, and make foreground color gray. Then press OK. Then take this time burn tool and apply this to make little bit darker. So our next work, we are going to adjust the color of our model because the background color is totally too yellow and uh, this model is little bit green so we are going to decrease the green color and convert this one into a yellow color so just click on filter and select camera raw sorry i think this one is not selected i now this one is selected and now select do the same thing and go to saturation oh sorry hue and in that portion or just click on here and just increase the, this one and decrease the yellow one so we can see that the yellow one is decreased here. then press ok just decrease the green one sorry then press ok Our next work we are going to add some light so just simply take a blank layer and go to set this one as linear dot and select solid color and I think this one is the best color ok then press ok right click blending option hold alt key and then press ok so this one is completed ok so click on masking layer and just take a paint bucket tool click on paint bucket tool and apply this now we are going to make foreground color white and select brush zoom your, your brush and zoom your document by pressing ctrl plus and then apply this
now we are going in our final adjustment and this one is a camera raw first we just make sure all adjustment are in perfect place so i want click on mask and just make a little bit change on this area because this one is a little bit artificial okay so the complete work is perfect and now we are going to mask the complete work in one layer so just hold shift ctrl alt plus e so the work is masked in one layer and make or the, just convert this one into a, a smart object then go to filter camera raw and start your adjustment So the our work is completed. If you like this tutorial, please subscribe my channel. Okay, see you soon with a new tutorial. Goodbye and thank you for watching.